The last time you saw this truck was in Arizona. It went down to Chandler, Arizona to race with the NHRDA. And at that race, we had some problems. For one, it left the line like a pogo stick. Thing bounced like crazy. It was awful. Also, the front end uh, steering components were not up to task. And they actually bent. The wheels came forward together, bent the tie rod. It was junk. So we had to fix those two things. We got in touch with Dodge Off-Road, and they hooked us up and got us a real sweet set of their front and steering components, which are very, very high-end and solved all those issues. We also put some AFCO shocks on the back. These are some coilover shocks. We got rid of the junk and put on some really nice tunable suspension. These are dual adjustable, meaning we can adjust the compression, how fast they compress. We can also adjust how fast they extend. And so with all that adjustability, we can hopefully get this thing dialed in. So once we got that put in, we headed to Salt Lake to a test and tune they had up there. We made one little first pass, we brought the power in way too quickly, and we blew off all four tires as soon as second gear hit. So then for the next pass, we, we softened it quite a bit. mid-pass, it just, something was off on it. So I pull back in the pits. It's running, but it's running rough. And so it seems like it's an injector problem. And sure enough, we start cracking lines, and we find we have an injector that had a broken needle in it. Yep, we broke an injector. No more drag race practice today. Uh, when we got back to the shop, we actually found we had three broken needles. And so that's just, it's kind of rare. It doesn't happen very often. I don't know if we had a bad batch of needles very rare to have one break, we'd have three break in one set. We kind of question, we maybe we just got a bad batch, overly brittle needles, whatever it is. It's definitely broken. Our new nozzles are here, we're making a new set of injectors. Leave a comment and subscribe, but honestly, probably the next week, probably not gonna do much commenting on YouTube. We're very, very busy here in the shop. I'll try to get on there and respond if I can, but don't be offended if I'm not on there responding for the next couple of weeks. Thanks, we'll see you next time.